Hi uh, y'all, Bobby here. Today we're going to get a little bit of travel. And not my normal top 10 random list. I'm going to focus a little bit on some travel. And since it's pretty cold up here in northern Colorado this week, it's going to be a little bit of tropical travel. Uh, I myself have done a little bit of travel. I've been to the Bahamas, I've been to Mexico, uh, you know, I worked on a yacht when I lived in South Florida. So, kind of some of that tropical travel is good to check out sometime. So let's kick off the list with Gone with the Winds. This is a couple who documents their sailing adventures around the world. And just recently they were in Tonga. So I would definitely check out their Tonga series and I'm going to try to start posting some links to specific videos this time so you can kind of see where I got started on some of these. So Gone with the Winds is pretty cool. They, it's this couple who has a nice sailing boat and they just go all over the place. And moving from sailing to Mexico, so Tangerine Travels. Tangerine Travel is, was a couple, um, I'll leave it at that. You can check out and understand why I say was. Um, they talk about the daily life in Mexico, um, what it's like to be in Mexico for, for a couple. Um, a male and a female, what their perspectives are. Kind of a neat aspect and way they see about it. It's pretty cool. Um, moving from Tangerine to Yes Theory. So Yes Theory is traveling or doing things that get you outside your comfort zone. Now, some things are pretty neat where you're going to Dubai and I'll, I'll definitely post the link on where he goes to Dubai. Um, you know, not necessarily tropical but warm. Uh, but kind of tropical, yeah. And so, moving from getting out of your comfort zone to New York City, um, Eric Hoover, he has epic travel all over the world and is a New York City real estate agent. So, you got some New York City stuff kind of tied in there. My, myself, I actually lived in upstate New York for some time. So, a little minor relation to that, uh, which is pretty cool. So, moving from New York City to cycling. So, Josh Reed, this video, I'll definitely post this video. He cycled from China to England. 15,000 kilometers. That's a haul. I mean, it's pretty crazy. All of his adventures and all the little paths he went through there, it was pretty cool to check out. And then, moving on to another traveler that goes to locations that most people wouldn't dare go to, but, you know, some people have to check it out. And I've talked about this guy before, Indigo Traveler. Um, the North Korea series really hooked me. Um, I'll post a link to some of those North Korea videos because those are really cool. Um, very, very different. Um, but, you know, it's pretty cool. So, back to some tropical. Lucas T. John, um, the Maldives. Uh, that's definitely a place that I've looked at going to. Uh, the plane ride to get there, a little bit disconcerting, but that's okay. That's me and planes. But definitely worth checking out. Um, as well as Anton Somewhere. His trip to Norway, that was really cool. Um, I'll specifically post the Norway link as well. And then Kara and Nate. Um, this is a couple that does all different kinds of traveling videos. But one that kind of got me was their 48 hours on a raft on a Canadian lake. Um, they literally built a flat raft, put a tent on it, them and another couple went out on a lake and spent 48 hours on a lake with all their food and all their ways to cook food and a bathroom, everything all done on the lake, on a Canadian lake. Did some swimming. It was really cool. So the last one on the list is more uh, J Stew. Uh, that one's some travel challenges per se. Um, one of the cool ones that I watched was where they go out to the frying pan. Um, I'll leave it at that. You should definitely check out the frying pan videos. Uh, it's really cool going out there. Kind of scary. Um, not something that I would do. Even though I've been out on the open ocean, definitely uh, not in my wheelhouse. But that's our list for the week. Please uh, like, subscribe, tell me what you think. Give me some ideas. Uh, I'm going to start kind of theming these lists to where they narrow down each week. You know, I'll have probably have a week on cars, a week on science, um, a week on maybe some history or some videos in that realm. So please tell me what you think and uh, give me some comments down below. Have a good day.